Hello and welcome to the HW Group Sense Desk Video Tutorial Part 2. My name is Christopher and I'll be guiding you through creating locations. Today I'll show you how you can create locations. The location function can be very useful in some situations where you need to distinguish the place of the device and the place of the sensors. So let's get started. Go to the top of the screen and click on locations. Here we can see our locations and the create new locations button. So click on that. First is the name of the location. We will use the name test. The team is set automatically, so we don't need to change that. And here we can write some notes in the description. If you want to, you can add the address of your devices also here. We're going to use our address for HW Group. So for Manska 296 14900 and Prague. Okay. Now we will add the devices to our location here. If our devices have locations, we can also add sensors from the devices to the sublocations, but we will go through this in the next video. Here we have all our devices which don't have any locations assigned to them. So we will choose this device here, and now you can see that we have one selected item. At the moment we have one device in our location. We're now ready to save and they will be assigned to our new locations. If we go through this process again, then the remaining devices would not include the one we just assigned. In this case, just one device would show. Okay, so click Save. And now we can see the device which we just chose. If we go up to the top, click Locations, we have the name of the location displayed here. We have the number of sensors and the state of the sensors. Here we have four in the OK, we have zero in alarm, we have zero in invalid, and we have zero in disabled. And at the moment, we don't have any created sublocations under location. So all the sensors from devices are in the not assigned sublocation. If we need to change something in locations, for example, change devices, we just click on the name of the location like so. You can view your devices, you can edit your location, or you can manage the sublocation of your locations. And in the case that we no longer need this location, we can just delete it. So that's it. I hope this was helpful and see you in the next video.